it's there. Good, so let's do the heel. So let's get a, let's get a, a bristle brush, probably a small bit of bristle brush, maybe a size two or three, just a small, just so that you can work with it. And just get um, some brown paint is good. Get a brown paint is fine. We just want to draw the shape out first, okay? So let's just draw the shape out first. Put some brown paint on your brush and figure out where you want your heel. And just take a line over here and bring it over and down or wherever you want it. And bring it over, make some humps. Maybe come down a little bit, okay? So then you can start filling it in with some brown paint. And your paint underneath is going to be wet, and that's fine. That's okay. We just want to get a shape there, and we can always fill it in with darks and lights after. Don't forget to do your sides, okay? Do your sides. So let's just get something going there so we can get some shapes. Good. All right, so we're going to get that because... Now, if you prefer, you can wait for that paint to dry so you don't have to put on layers and layers of paint to get the colors you're looking for. But I'm going ahead because I'm doing the video and I don't want to delay. I want to get it done for you because I've been re getting requests for this painting for a few months. I was uh, gone all summer to uh, Alberta and I, um, and I just got back not long ago. So now I want to dig right into doing some videos for you and have some fun. So because this is a bigger canvas, I'm making my heels a little bigger. You don't have to have them that big if you don't want to. But for the video, I'd like to show you how they're done. Some little humps here and there. Okay, good. So what we'll do is, when we come back, we're going to add some darks to this, these hills. So you work on those hills, and you work on the sky. And when we come back, we will finish up the hills and we will probably put a few little clouds in the sky and then we'll continue on with the with the water and then the beach so we'll do it in steps and have some fun so i'll see you in lesson two of the big wave